First alert forecast, certified most accurate since 2004. Well, a live look up for your Saturday evening from our Stark State camera. This is down towards the Akron area and what a beautiful start to the weekend. I mean, we've had tons of sunshine, not much in the way of cloud cover, a beautiful sunset this evening. Hopefully you were able to catch that. But really, I mean, this pattern hasn't changed a whole lot day to day, and we're going to continue on this trend as we wrap up the weekend and really this last official weekend of the summer season. Tonight it is dry. It is clear. Temperatures are once again headed for the upper 50s to lower 60s, and you could almost say it's a copy and paste forecast tomorrow. We're going to see that lake breeze kick in late afternoon. If you're closer to downtown Cleveland or anywhere along the lake shore, bear that in mind. Temperatures will once again be headed back for the 80s, but as we train transition from the weekend then into the upcoming work week. There are a lot of bigger changes on the way. Sure, it's a nice dry start to the weekend, but something that we desperately need some rain. It is possible as we go through the middle part of this next week and on top of which we're going to add in a little bit more of this humidity as well. This has been a component we really haven't had to talk a whole lot about the last several days, even though it has been significantly warmer than average for where we should be for this time of the year. That humidity has stayed pretty low which is a good thing for us, but we're going to slowly see that change as we bring in some more tropical like moisture associated with the system that's trying to get better organized tonight and will continue to over the next couple of days. You can actually see some of these higher cloud tops here just off that Carolina coastline. This is some shower and thunderstorm development that the National Hurricane Center has been watching for the last several days. And as we expected, as we got earlier to the early part of this next week, the odds that we could potentially potentially see some tropical development continue to increase, but it has a very short amount of time to do that. You really only have until Monday before we do anticipate that this system is going to move on shore, regardless of any type of tropical development. What we can say, though, is as that happens, it's bringing with it a little bit of that tropical moisture and some slightly better opportunities for rain. Now, our impacts will largely depend on how quickly this big area of high pressure that's been keeping our weather so nice the last couple of days can break down and kind of move out of our area to allow some of this moisture into the far eastern portions of Ohio. And a lot of this newer data is painting that we may actually continue to see those odds increasing Wednesday, especially headed into Thursday. But I can't completely rule out a couple late evening showers on Tuesday as we're starting to see that moisture return, but you'll notice on this particular view of your future view as we go through Wednesday evening, it, this may be our best shot of seeing some of these showers across the area. It's a quick chance by Thursday morning. We're starting to see the system already pull away from us, and so we basically have this very short window in order to pick up any rain, and it may be our best chance over the next several days because right now, if you look at this more extended outlook, it does appear that we are going to be keeping some of these drier conditions still in place across our area. So fingers crossed. Even if we do see rain, may not be a ton, maybe upwards of a quarter of an inch, maybe a half of an inch of rain, but at least it's going to knock that temperature down by a couple of degrees. Still pretty comfortable here as we go through the middle part of the work week as we increase those clouds and hopefully increase that opportunity for some showers across the area. Late week looking dry and really staying on the sunny side as we head into the early part of this next weekend. Coming up in the next half hour, though, there is something that may have you staying up a little bit later or waking up earlier on Monday morning. And yes, it is the potential for the Northern Lights. We'll talk more about that coming up.